you know, I, I was really lucky at the time to have a, a director who, you know, kept his hands uh, away from like talking about, you know, some of the words you don't want to talk about, right? The labor and the food cost and, and what we were doing. And I was like, hey, what are we doing with people? And, you know, for me, that was uh, the first inkling of just walking in here, creating a, you know, a foundation of trust. Um, and then really like kind of practicing what I preached, right? It, it was, you know, you had a bad shift. You spoke about it. You had a great shift. You high fived about it, and then you started really digging into staff and like what was making them tick, how long they've been in the restaurant, what were some of the things that they, you know, listening to your team. I think that's a huge part of of sometimes where operators miss is your team will know the answers, and and our staff knew the answers. They knew we couldn't get food out fast enough. They knew service maybe wasn't quick enough. Maybe they knew the facility wasn't clean enough. And so, you know, we focused on that. And I mean, I think I started in September of twenty sixteen. But I really think the people side and the culture of where the brand really thought about people and growth and development and career paths. Team, we were the number 10 location. And when we got to January 2017, we were the number one location in, in the in the brand. And, and here wow. we are seven years later, and that store is, I think, a top three store in the brand for us. 